Terio, move. Terio, because you post a new girl on TikTok every week. Come on, brother. So you guys, you guys, I want to bring out this video on Mikey and Jada Williams just because we definitely got some things we got to talk about. So just recently, a few of my subscribers has been requested for me to make this video after Mikey decided to break up with Jada. So you already know, we're going to go over this and let's just talk about what's going on behind the scenes between these two. So we all know Mikey is currently 17 years old. If you guys do not know, his birthday will be coming up in a few days on June the 26th, which is on a Sunday. So happy early birthday to Mikey. But like I said, Mikey right now, he's currently 17 years old. He also is a senior attending San Ysidro High School that's located in San Diego. Right now, he is currently ranked 21st in the class of 2023, holding 28 plus offers for multiple Division I schools. We all know Mikey started off his high school career attending San Ysidro for his freshman year and for his sophomore year. That's when he decided to transfer across the country to Lake Norman Christian Academy. Then for his junior year, that's when he went to Vertical Academy. So now for his senior year, he decided to transfer back to the West Coast and he's going to finish off his senior season attending San Isidro. So I'm very excited to see what he's going to do. If you guys do not know, back in February on the 18th, that's when Puma decided to fly Mikey out to All-Star Weekend. And the very next day he left. But here's the thing. On February the 22nd, that's when Mikey took an unofficial visit to University of Southern California. So it's going to be very interesting to see what school he's going to commit to. In my opinion, it's going to happen throughout his senior year for sure. But he definitely got his options open. And it seems like he's going to go to a school on the West Coast. I'm not 100% sure. But like I said in my last video, Mikey is trying to take LaMelo Ball's route. And if you guys do not know, when LaMelo was a senior at Ten Inspire Institute, he wanted to go to University of Southern California. But the NCAA denied his eligibility. So for Mikey Williams, I would not be surprised at all. And if you guys do not know, back on April the 23rd, Mikey was playing a few games with LaMelo Ball's 1 of 1 17U team. So as you can see, he's going to be busy with LaMelo Ball's AAU team throughout the summer, including playing summer league with San Isidro. So you guys, we definitely got some things we got to talk about because it seems like Mikey is not putting up with the things that Jada is doing on the low. Now, I know some of y'all remember my last video I made on these two back in March. Well, as you can see, this is an update, but here's the thing. Now, back in March, when Mikey and Jada was both at Destin, Florida together, I know you guys remember when they went on Instagram Live and everything together, including the very next day, they were showing each other on their IG story, taking pictures and everything. But here's the thing. Before they went to Destin, Florida together, Jada was on Instagram Live on March the 21st, and she was just chilling. I guess, you know, she didn't have to go to school during that day. But this guy named Ontario Morris, a.k.a. Terrio, he was commenting all on her Instagram Live. At first, she was ignoring him. But then she just starts to respond to him, you know, a little bit. And you could tell that she was liking the attention that he was giving her because he was all on her Instagram live, commenting all types of stuff, talking about her braids and stuff. And you could tell that he really was trying to back her on the low. And if y'all don't know who this guy is, like I said, his name is Ontario Morris. Right now, he's currently 18 years old, attending University of Texas. He graduated in the class of 2022 and he was ranked 22nd in his class. So as you can see, he was a top player coming out of high school, just like Mikey Williams. So Jada definitely got her eyes open. And during that Instagram live, Terio even commented, bro, I'm over here crying. Jada and Jada responded, Terio, do you really think I care? Do you really? And even one time, Terio, he responded to her and he said, bro, ain't no way, Jada. How he know about my ex, though? And he was talking about some guy that commented about his ex-girlfriend. Then Jada responded to Terio and said, Terio, because you post a new girl on TikTok every week. Come on, brother. And she claimed that Terio is her brother type. So... That's very, very interesting because just recently she's been commenting on his pictures a lot. So when we fast forward a week later after that Instagram live, that's when Mikey and Jada decide to go to Destin, Florida together with some friends and family. So here's the thing. On March 28th, during like 12 in the morning, Jada, she went on Instagram live and she was getting lit and stuff. But here's the thing. Mikey was nowhere to be found. And he also was mad because he was speaking out on some things on Instagram, talking about family and stuff. And also he deactivated his Instagram account. But right after he deactivated his Instagram account, Jada was on live, like I said, getting lit with her friends. And she was just acting like she did not care at all. And it's just so funny because even during the Instagram live, Mikey texted somebody that was in the room with them. I guess it was a family member or one of her friends. And basically, the person that Mikey texted, she said out loud, Mikey texted me, are you guys in the house? Then right after she said that, everybody in the room just started to laugh and make fun of Mikey. So later during that day, they went jet skiing. Then the very next day on March the 29th, that's when Mikey and Jada went on a double date with another couple. 
Then two days later, that's when Jada decides to post pictures of her and Mikey. And Mikey commented on a picture saying, I love you. And he also posted on his Instagram story a picture of him and Jada on his phone background. And we all know Mikey don't play because if he really mess with you, he's going to show the world that he mess with you. He's always going to show you love, including putting you on his phone background because he did the same for Deja Kelly. You know what I mean? So then when you fast forward on April the 29th, Jada had a college visit at UCLA. Then about a week later on May the 8th, that's when Jada posted the pictures of her college visit at UCLA. Then Mikey commented and said 8 and he put the happy face emoji with the heart eyes. So as you can see, Mikey really do like Jada. He always been showing us he likes her, you guys. And that's why I've been keeping y'all updated on these videos because it's clear, it's obvious. But Jada, she's been doing things on the low because on May the 12th, which was four days after he commented on her picture, Mikey decided to deactivate his instagram out of nowhere and i was just wondering why did he deactivate his instagram this time and come to find out two days later on may the 14th jada was going to the prom with some of her friends and i guess with somebody else you know what i mean and you already know mikey was not messing with that because he's been showing this girl love these past what few months ever since they've been talking and now that she's going to the prom with her friends or whatever you can just tell it's just on some sneaky stuff and mikey is not rocking with it because he's been going through all this with daisy kelly and now jada is like on the same type of timing if that makes sense so it is kind of sad because y'all know me i've been supporting these two like for real so then when you fast forward three weeks later that's when mikey decides to reactivate his instagram on june the 8th so that's almost like a month he deactivated his instagram for about a month you guys so you already know mikey was not feeling it he was definitely going through some stuff then he posted a picture and the caption says swear i'm getting too much money to be worried about a n-word so as you can see he's not playing yo he is not playing and i really feel like that was a message towards jada and that other dude that i was talking about but i definitely want you guys to leave your comments and opinions below on how y'all feel about this i thank you guys for watching if you make sure you like subscribe make sure you press the notification button t game we out hey bro Stop lagging me. Like a lean. Look at this bot. He's a bot. You're a bot. You're a bot. Get in. Are you scared? So, we're only in Florida for how many days? It's actually not that cold. If it was cold, I'd get out. Oh! Just go, just go. Why are you going backwards? <laughs> See? You didn't have to do all that. You didn't have to. Shh. He didn't even have to. He didn't even have to do all that. He could have just got in waist deep, but he went under the boat. There you go. That shit is shocking. He said, oh, he was hanging on the boat. <laughs>